What if I told you the future of basketball could have been completely different if two of the greatest players in NBA history had stayed together? It's one of the biggest what ifs in NBA history, and now we're finally going to answer that question in this video. Hey, welcome to Downward Dog, where we bring you the most mind-boggling scenarios. Subscribe now and join our community. Hey there, basketball fans. Get ready to sit back and imagine a world where the Lakers never broke up the dynamic duo of Shaq and Kobe. That's right, we're exploring the five hypothetical scenarios of what could have happened if these two legends had stayed together. With five possible scenarios to consider, you won't want to miss a single moment of this video. So grab your popcorn, sit back, and prepare to dive into the what-if world of Shaq and Kobe. Will they have won more championships? achieved greater individual success, earned even more money, or become cultural icons beyond the world of basketball? You'll have to watch until the end to find out. Now, for those of you who don't know, Shaquille O'Neal and Kobe Bryant were two of the greatest basketball players of all time, and they played together on the Los Angeles Lakers in the early 2000s. They won three NBA championships together, but then in 2004, their relationship became strained, and Shaq was traded to the Miami Heat. Now, imagine if that never happened. Imagine if Shaq and Kobe had been able to put their egos and differences aside and continued to play together. What would have happened? Well, that's what we're going to be exploring today. But first, let's talk about why Shaq left in the first place. You see, Shaq and Kobe were both alpha males who wanted to be the leader of the team. This led to a lot of tension and conflict between them, both on and off the court. There were also rumors of infidelity on Kobe's part, which only made things worse. In the end, the Lakers had to choose between Shaq and Kobe, and they chose Kobe. Shaq was traded to the Miami Heat, where he went on to win another championship in 2006. Meanwhile, Kobe struggled to lead the Lakers to a winning record without Shaq. Here's the top five scenarios for what would happen if Shaq and Kobe had stayed together. Scenario number one, more championships. One of the most obvious scenarios that could have happened if Shaq and Kobe had stayed together is that they would have won even more championships. As you may know, they won three championships in a row from 2000 to 2002, but then their relationship soured and Shaq was traded to the Miami Heat. However, if they had kept their egos in check and focused on winning, they could have had continued their championship success for several more years. Imagine the Lakers as a dynasty team, with Shaq dominating the paint and Kobe scoring from the perimeter. It's possible they could have won five or even six championships in a row, cementing their legacy as one of the greatest teams in the history of the NBA. Don't forget to hit that like button and share this video with your friends who love basketball what-ifs. Scenario number two, dynamic duo legacy. If Shaq and Kobe had stayed together, they would have gone down in history as one of the greatest dynamic duos in NBA history. Their combination of inside and outside skills, size, and athleticism made them virtually unstoppable when they played together. They would have been remembered as one of the most dominant tandems in basketball history, with fans and analysts marveling at their ability to work together despite their conflicts. Scenario number three, more personal records individually. Shaq and Kobe both could achieve even more personal records if they had played together for longer. Shaq was a dominant force in the paint and could have continued to set records for rebounds, blocks, and points. Kobe was an incredible scorer and could have continued to climb the all-time scoring list. Together, they could have achieved even more individual success while contributing to the team's success as a whole. They may have been able to break scoring records, win more championships, and make more all-star appearances. Their combined talents were formidable, and they likely would have continued to achieve great things on the court. Scenario number four, more money. As two of the most famous and successful basketball players of all time, Shaq and Kobe could have earned even more money if they had stayed together. Their endorsement deals, TV appearances, and other opportunities would have been even more lucrative if they had continued to play together and win championships. They could have become even bigger icons in sports and entertainment, with their influence and impact felt far beyond the basketball court. Do you think Shaq and Kobe could have become even more successful if they had continued to play together? 
Leave a comment and let us know your thoughts. Scenario number five, legacy beyond basketball. Finally, if Shaq and Kobe had stayed together, their legacy would have extended far beyond the world of basketball. You see, Shaq went on to have a successful career with the Heat, winning another championship in 2006. But Kobe struggled to lead the Lakers without Shaq, and it wasn't until a few years later, when he teamed up with Pau Gasol, that he was able to win another championship. They could have become cultural icons, inspiring future generations of athletes and fans with their teamwork, dedication, and competitive spirit. Their influence on the game of basketball would have been felt for decades, with future players modeling their own games after Shaq's power and Kobe's finesse. The combined popularity and success of Shaquille O'Neal and Kobe Bryant could have led to opportunities outside of basketball, including business ventures and philanthropic efforts. However, their strained personal relationship could have continued to overshadow their professional success and limit the scope of their legacy beyond basketball. So there you have it, folks. That's our take on what might have happened if Shaq and Kobe had stayed together. Would Shaq and Kobe have been even more dominant if they had stayed together? Or do you think their egos would have gotten in the way eventually? We'd love to hear your thoughts. If you enjoyed today's video, be sure to show your support by giving it a like and sharing it with others. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications so you never miss upcoming videos. Thanks for joining me today, and I'll see you in the next video.